Hey up guys, it's Clyde here, and welcome to Let's Play Rain. I have no idea what this game is about, I know that it rains. That's all I know. This is going to be a blind Let's Play. How interesting. Alright, let's start the game. Um, new story. Oh wait, options first, of course, gotta go to the options, just to make sure everything is okay. Um, doesn't seem like there are any subtitles, so I guess that's okay then. <laughs> yeah, sure, okay, new story. Let's do it. Yes, I'd like to start a new story, please.
Chapter 1, The Children and the Night. Okay then, Jesus H. Christ. This seems very interesting, very interesting indeed. I'd just like to point out though, this game is actually free on PlayStation Plus for the PS3 um, as of August, which is when I'm recording this. So if you do have PlayStation Plus and you're watching in August of 2015, you can get this game for free, so keep that in mind. Alright, so, I have a feeling that stealth is going to be, like, quite a big part of this game, and it's, like, it's so interesting. It's like, you know, you get out of the rain, and then you're invisible. Uh, you get in the rain, and you're then visible again. So, how the hell am I going to see where I am? That's my question, because if I'm invisible, how am I really going to know where I am? Because I can't really control the camera. Is there a sprint button? I'm not exactly sure. Maybe I can make that jump. Uh, that was a, a bit of a... A, a gimpy hop, I'll say. Um, is there a sprint button? Oh, square seems... Yes, yeah, square seems to make me run. I don't know what made me press square to run, but okay. Uh, that's a bit of an interesting button. Right, um... Where the hell am I going? Do I just go straight? Oh, rain. There's the title, of course. Interestingly not spelled with any capitalization. Um, I guess I'll just go through here. Why not? So I'm invisible now, if I go in here. Is that correct? Yes, I'm invisible. Oh, okay. Oh, right, yeah, see? Um, the little footsteps on the ground. Oh, wow. The places where the rain did not reach. Oh, shit, I missed that. Oh, my God. I'm so bad. Uh, I guess I've got to kind of watch out for, like, stepping on things like this because I'll knock them over. And that might alert things. Yeah, not very good. So, it's a little bit hard to tell where you are. You can only, like, see little tiny splashes on the ground. But, you know, I think I can manage it. I'm not exactly sure. We'll see. We'll see. Let's just run through this. Yeah, like, as you can see. So, oh, shit. It's really hard to tell exactly where I am. But I suppose that's part of the challenge of it. And it would seem like we're actually um, in Paris or somewhere in France, it would seem, anyway. Uh, mainly because the music, I think. The music's kind of giving this away. Let's just sprint through this then, shall we? To escape the uncertainty of being visible, he needed to find rain. But. Yes, but what? Uh, oh, can I get on the back of this truck, do you think? Um, no, I guess that's a blocked path. Ah, oh, unfortunate. Oh, here we go. If he could see himself, it meant others could see him too. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. Uh, ooh, ooh. Can I get through here? Examine. Uh, how do I examine? The gate before him was bent out of shape. The boy, not, the, the boy did not have the strength to open it. Ah, so a circle is examine. Okay, uh, square is run. Any other buttons? Anything? Um, did I do that? Or I have no idea. Oh my god, I'm so confused. Okay then, I'm being chased by what look like dogs. The art style in this game is absolutely fantastic. Okay then, so... We managed to escape that. Interesting. Uh, do I just go through here, maybe? Um, no, I guess not. I, I kind of can't really tell where I'm going here. Do I go back? Uh, I really don't think I do. I'm not feeling going back there. Oh, wait, maybe I do. Ah, so the girls figured it out as well. Now, why are we chasing this girl? I know that, like, he probably wants to save the girl, but... What is his intention? You know, just to save the girl and that's it. Do I have to go where the dogs came from? Um, oh, the gate. Yes, of course. They broke the gate down and now we can go through. Amazing. All right. So this should lead us to a lower level, I hope. Um, I'm smelling the secret. Is there a secret here? Um, no, I can't go through that door. You know, I'm kind of feeling like there might be some secrets in this game. It does seem like a, maybe an adventure game mixed in with a puzzle game mixed in with sort of like a, like a stealth game. Hmm, there's a lot of combinations there. What is this stuff on the ground anyway? Is it just a reflection of the lights? It must be. Uh, yeah, there's no secrets around here, by the looks of it anyway. Ah, that's unfortunate. I thought there might be some like, little pieces of paper, some soggy bits of paper. The girl disappeared down the road ahead. Only the boy and the two beasts were left on. Oh, you fuck! Uh, well, that scared the shit out of me. I was trying to read the goddamn things on the screen. So I guess, oh, I can hide in here. And maybe they don't know. Um, okay, his only choice was to make his way past without being seen. Alright then, so, this requires a bit of patience, I would assume. 
I should wait for that guy or that little dog thing, whatever it is, creature, to turn around and I should be able to sneak past. There we go. Is there a button to like crouch or walk silently or something? Because my footsteps are kind of loud right now. I'm not really a big fan of that. Um, any more of these things? Doesn't look like it. I'm probably going to get chased and I'm probably going to die a lot. Um, I'm invisible. Oh, and the bush shelter. Of course, I'm invisible in the bush shelter. Oh my god. He could see a roof. Safety. But it was a long way off. He would have to run for it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I see how it goes. Alright then. I can't even see where I am, but I'm going to make a run for it. I hope I have to turn left here. I hope this is the way to the roof. Holy shit, I tripped. And he got me through the wall? What the fuck, wall hack? Maybe that wasn't the right way to go. Uh, now we know these creatures have wall hacks. Let's have a look again. Where exactly do we go? You know, it does seem like I was meant to go up those stairs there. Um, Alright, let's try and go a different route since that one didn't seem to work that time. Um, hopefully they don't catch me. They are, of course, uh, dog creatures, so they're probably much faster than I am. And uh, yes, I'm now invisible. Oh, this is where I'm meant to go. Okay, so I wasn't meant to go up there. You had to come to associate invisibility with safety. But. Oh, shit. What's the but here? Uh, but what? Come on. Out of the downpour, they vanished into nothingness. Only the sound of the... Oh, shit, man. So they're invisible as well. Fantastic. Great. So now I've got to watch their footsteps. Uh, I'm so glad they have a pattern to them, and they're not actually, like, just randomised. Praise the Lord! Oh shit, there's another dog. Um, his way forward is blocked by a beast. Yes, it is. I'm gonna have to get inside this little area here. Oh shit! Okay, um, I have to make a loud noise then. Uh, what can I use to make a loud sound? Maybe I can make it chase me? Hey, bitch! Uh, well, that didn't work. That doesn't seem like it'd be the right idea. Maybe? It probably told me in that little bit of text there, but I was kind of focusing on something else. Um, ah, maybe a splash in the puddles? Oh, well, there we go then. That kind of worked. Please don't see me. Thank you, my good man. Ooh. So that's how you do it then. You jump in the puddles, and of course, they are distracted by the sound. I was trying to like tap him on the ass, you know, and trying to make him turn around because maybe I could have got invisible and they've never known. Um, just turned a running jump. Ugh, there we go. Oh, what's he doing? What oh, absolute spaz! He just murdered himself. No, they killed themselves. What the hell are they doing? Oh my god. Well, that's interesting. Um, where am I? I actually don't know where I am anymore. Oh, there I am at the left. Oh, shit. Shit. Um, well, there's four of them. I'm probably going to need to run up and in here. Uh, this is this is just a guess, a complete guess. And then, hopefully, they don't see me. Oh, shit. Distractionary techniques. Of course, I could do this. Hide in the corner. Oh. And, of course, they're not, <laughs> they're not distracted by the water puddles at all, are they? Um, if I step in the water, does that matter? Uh, it would seem like that's safe. Oh, please. I almost walked straight out of the, like, underneath this awning then. That would have been bad. Okay, turn around. There we go. And I can go exactly where the girl went. Oh my god, they're chasing me. I'm glad they can't climb, though. Otherwise, I would probably be dead. Just then, he saw her again. How the hell do I... Oh, a ladder. Do you think I can just... Nope. How the hell did she get up there, then? When the girl appeared, she was not alone. The moon lit up the stairs as if to guide him. Examine. Okay. The scaffolding towered above him, preventing him from reaching the moonlit stairway beyond. Okay, that's a really good examination there. I guess I could just go around the back and climb those stairs though, right? Uh, most likely not, yeah. Just as I thought, fucking hell. Um, 
Where can I hide? Uh, in here. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. No, they're gonna hit with a- What the fuck?! Okay, let's try that again. Hopefully this time, I don't get absolutely wreck-a-rooned. Um, so what the hell do I do? Uh, I have an idea. Okay, run. Uh, this is my idea. It's to run through the whole building. Don't, like, stop underneath there. Go straight through. And I can't do that! Of course I can't do- Oh, what the fuck? Maybe I can do that. And the camera just decided to change itself. Um, that was very odd. Well, there we go then. Uh, the first impact hadn't done quite enough to break the scaffolding. <laughs> well, I didn't know that's what I had to do. I knew they could do that. I guess there's another one here then. Um, no? Where's the next guy then? Well, the next little dog thing. Probably around the corner, no doubt. Um, I'm going to have to like lead him through this whole area. And the dogs are a bit faster than me. He found the beast lurking at the end of the alleyway. Yeah, the dogs are slightly faster than me. So, I'm not exactly sure if I could outrun them. Hey, bitch! Come on, then. Turd burglar. Here we go! Okay. Gun it. We have to gun this. Oh, my God. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, my God. I had an idea, then. This is my idea. Go off, you fuck! Okay, we'll try that again. My idea was to sort of hide invisible like this so that he'll stop looking so that I can get a bit more of a head start on the guy. That's the plan. It might not work, but, you know... I'll try it. Okay, go, go, go. And then we hide in the invisibility. There we go. And then we fucking run again. Ah! And then we hide. Oh my god, please. And then we run again. And then we hide again. This is how we do this. And then... Go for it. We're gone. We're gone in it. We're gone in it. Oh my god. I think he might catch up to me on this one. No, he won't. Okay, please hit the thing. There we go. Why are they so drawn to, like, bashing their heads into scaffolding? What is that about? Dear, dear, dear. But now, we can go and find that girl. Of course, I just tipped over that chair there. I do apologise. It's actually a stool. I correct myself. That is a stool. Chapter 1. The Children and the Night. Finn. 